Good old super snapper. Those are rotten. That's a ch that's the char for today. Fix those boards. And we have new ones there with some carpet as well. So let's give that a go. So as you can tell, they're a little wonky, which means that's rubbing. We don't want that rubbing. Look at that. It's all rotted out. We got to fix that. We got to fix that for sure. There's another thing we gotta fix. Cute little repair, huh? <laughs> so my tentative plan is to lift it up and put a two by on this lip, keep it high enough so I can access those underneath there. There. One, two, and then the carpet. All right, let's give this a go. Maybe? Whoa. Just enough, I think. That's plenty of room. So I have screws here and the other side and there and the other side. Take those out and we're in business. One. So now, measure this guy, cut it the same size. So we got 60 inches. I'm gonna put pants and a long sleeve on. Mosquitoes are getting nasty. Next up, figure out how to wrap these in carpet. I'm just gonna try stapling it, cutting it to size and then wrapping it and stapling it. Seems easy enough. Okay, it looks like we need just shy of 10 inches to wrap the whole thing. 10, 10, I gotta adjust that. Okay, now the trick is to figure out wrapping it. So I'm laying it down upside down, the carpet, placing this on there, and then we'll fold over, fold over, staple all along, and then cut, cut the excess. I'm gonna do this end first. And figure out how I gotta cut it. So we're going cut this off to here. Leave a strip to this corner. And that's gonna wrap underneath like that. Oh, that was a nice cut. I like it. I like it a lot. I'm going to cut this chunk off too. Nice. So then this piece, we have kind of flap in here that's going to fold under here and reinforce that corner. Ooh, hit it a little harder, Lee. Jeez. 
lightweight. And do that on the other side. And then last, lastly, wrap the whole side over. Let's give it a flip. Boom. You're going in there. You. You. Look at them apples. All shiny and new. And no, I didn't use stainless steel. Oh well. I'm not going to on the screws either. The screws that were in there have been in there for 10 plus years and they're not stainless. I'll just probably replace them later. Maybe. Bam. Shablammy. That looks very nice. That's the nicest thing on there. I just got to do that to the other side but anyways thanks for watching super simple fix if you do have uh, uh, wood runners like that whatever those are called on the trailer super easy fix that's all I have that that's all that's the only thing else I have to say thanks for watching <laughs> the other one was the other one was so bad. Look at this. When this gets wet, it gets all soggy and nasty. There was a hole that was forming. There was a hole that is wearing into the boat too, where the metal was hitting, which I'm not too worried about right now, but you can see it right there. Just on the surface, but that could have that could have had some problems as we go. <laughs> subscribe please subscribe to the video or to my channel